The Lake House is an open, simple platform to store and manage all of your data and support all of your analytics and AI use cases. SQL Analytics allows data analysts and SQL users to query all of the data in the Lake House by offering scalable, cost-effective clusters optimized for SQL workloads. When combined with Delta Lake, the open-source storage layer for data lakes, you get the reliability of ACID transactions and query results with lightning-fast performance, even with multiple concurrent users. On top of that, SQL Analytics also makes it easier to quickly visualize and share insights with a new and easy-to-use SQL Query Editor, rich dashboards, and automatic alerts. Or you can connect SQL Analytics endpoints to a broad set of BI tools, including Tableau and Power BI for reliable data and fast query performance. SQL Analytics allows you to build a lakehouse architecture that provides data warehousing performance at Data Lake Economics for better price and performance than traditional cloud data warehouses. Let's look at an example. Imagine that you and I are data analysts at a large coffee company, and we want to determine which countries to source beans from this week to get the best value. To find some relevant data, let's look through the data lake using the data browser. Once we choose the coffee database, we can see the tables it contains and the schema of each one, including the names and data types of each column. This looks like the data we need. Let's write a query to find the average rating of coffee beans in each country using the interactive query editor. SQL Analytics Live Autocomplete offers suggestions to help us find what we're searching for quickly, and pressing the Tab button accepts a suggestion. A chart could probably help us understand the information more easily, so let's visualize this data. As you can see, we have lots of options. Funnels, Sankey charts, sunbursts, and more. But let's choose a map, since our data is grouped by country. Looks good. We're going to want to keep an eye on this query, so let's give it a name. Add some searchable tags and schedule it to run every 24 hours. Perfect! The rest of our data team should see this right away. SQL Analytics makes it easy to add this chart to a dashboard and share it directly with key stakeholders. We can also use the access controls to tailor permissions on a group wide basis. So now that we have some good ratings data, we should also bring in some price data to help our stakeholders understand which beans offer the highest quality at the lowest price. So right now, it looks like Brazilian coffee offers us the best value. But if that changes, I'd like to know about it without having to check the dashboard every day. So with SQL Analytics, we can set up value-based alerts so that we'll get an email if the value per dollar dips below the threshold that we define. Now, just to switch gears a bit, let's imagine that we're administrators and let's walk through some of the controls we can use to manage our lake house. We can manage SQL endpoints from the Endpoints tab. SQL endpoints are optimized for low latency SQL workloads and offer fast query performance under high concurrency. They're easy to set up, too. We can select the size of cluster we want using simple t-shirt sizing. And we can add multi-cluster load balancing if we know we're going to have a lot of analysts querying the data at once so that the query performance doesn't suffer even under heavy load. We can also manage the query history. The query history allows us to view all the recent queries that ran on this endpoint. We can sort by query, endpoint, user, and time. Once we've selected a query, we can view details including phases of execution and query performance. This information is useful for debugging and performance optimization, as well as for audit and governance purposes. So the SQL Analytics UI works great for exploratory data analysis, quick dashboarding, and setting up alerts for you and your team. But if you already use an existing BI application like Tableau, Looker, or Power BI, you can still use SQL Analytics on the back end as the scalable query engine that provides clean, reliable data and fast query performance to power your applications. SQL Analytics offers data analysts a fresh new way to work and play with data and Databricks. Try SQL Analytics on Databricks today!